Hi guys! Welcome back to my channel. Today I'll be doing a hardback book haul. In the past few months I've acquired a few hardbacks and I do love them so much that I decided to show them to you. So let's get to it because there's quite a few of them. So the first book I'm going to show you is The Trouble with Goat and Sheep by Joanna Cannon. They admit that I got this because of the cover and the title. Because I did. It's true. I did. So this book is about two girls who decide to act as detectives and go after the neighbour who's missing. I got this copy in foils and it is signed by the author, which I think is quite nice. The next book I want to show you is The Butcher's Hook by Janet Ellis. This book has been making the rounds in booktube, I've noticed, so I decided to get my hands on it and see what it's all about. And again, look how pretty it is. The next book I'm going to show you is The Daughter of the Forest by Juliette Marillier. I got this book because I'm really in the mood to read something Celtic and with magic and this book just seems perfect for the job. I read it being described as uh, similar to The Mist of Avalon which I read as a teenager and just loved. Um, it's not Arthurian legend but it is Celtic, it's mystical, it's set in Ireland. Um, I don't know if there's a date here for the setting but I assume it's 12th, 13th century or so and I'm just really really looking forward to it because apparently there's a lot, of, there's lots of like women and girl power. So next up is Habitable Ball by Curtis Sittingfeld. This book is basically a fan fiction of Pride and Prejudice and Jane Austen is one of my favourite authors of all time. A few years ago six established authors were commissioned to write modern versions of Austen's novel and that is great. What bothers me a little bit is that people have been doing that for free for years now. <laughs> so this is the fourth book released as part of that project. We still have Persuasion and Mansfield Park to go if I'm not mistaken. So I decided to have a go at this one because I heard really good things about it. Next one is Reader I Married Him, Stories Inspired by Jane Eyre, by, edited by Tracy Chevalier, but I'm pretty sure there are lots of authors who have written the stories in this. I love Jane Eyre, it's one of my favourite novels of all time. And when I saw this, I had to have it. I haven't read it yet really really looking forward to as I am as Jane Eyre is one of the novels part of my PhD project I'll probably read it as soon as I start my PhD readings because I think this will be quite interesting to add to it. Next book is The Mad Woman Obsessed by Catherine Lowell and again it's Jane Eyre themed. It's about a woman who discovers that she is descendant of the Bronte sisters. And last but not least is Smoke by Dan Villetta. Everyone on booktube is talking about this book. People have been talking about this book for ages and I, it's finally out so well I grabbed it. This book is set in a world where sin is visible. It's visible in the form of smoke, soot and dirt on your body and I'm really really looking forward to reading this. That's it for today guys. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Let me know down in the comments if you've read any of these, what you thought of them, which one I should read first. Pick for me because there's too many and I don't know which one to pick. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. See you next time. Bye!